country music's biggest stars were just crowned at the 2024 CMT Awards. And let us tell you, it was a spectacle you won't forget. Prepare to see surprising winners, legendary collaborations, and moments that'll keep tongues wagging for a while. Billy Bob Thornton just gave me my third trophy of the night, y'all! Well, even the Queen Bay herself got a shout out. So make yourselves comfortable, because we've gathered up all the juicy highlights from the CMT Music Awards 2024. CMT has been a Nashville staple for two decades, but last year, the party moved to Austin's Moody Center. And let me tell you, it was packed with country stars and the most passionate fans you've ever seen. We spotted plenty of familiar faces among the presenters. Amber Riley, Billy Bob Thornton, Emma Roberts, Minnie Driver, Jane Seymour, and Gail King. Even the stars of Young Sheldon, Montana Jordan, and Emily Osmond got in on the country music action. They all took turns handing out awards and introducing sizzling performances. The winners were famously chosen by none other than the fans themselves. We'll delve into those wins a bit later. The crowd roared with approval as Kelsey Ballerini returned to the CMT stage for a record-breaking fourth year as host. She used to team up with Kane Brown, but this time she flew solo. And honestly, she didn't need any backup. She even managed to squeeze in nine outfit changes throughout the night. Talk about dedication. <laughs> mm, me doing the most? Always. Speaking of outfits, did you love Kelsey's Country Barbie look as much as we did? And she totally rocked that look when she strutted out with the other presenters. Kelsey kicked off the show with a hilarious bit where she tried to telepathically read the minds of the celebs whenever the camera cut to them in the audience. Let's just say her boyfriend Chase Stokes wasn't safe from her mind-reading antics. First she slides in my DMs, and now she's in my thoughts. Ballerini and her Outer Banks beau looked smitten on the red carpet, packing on the PDA. But back to Kelsey's mind-reading skills, here's what she could decipher from Keith Urban's thoughts. I was told I'd be next to Jelly Roll. I am not happy. Urban made history with his record-breaking 20th performance at the CMT Awards. He even debuted a brand new song, Straight Line, and the crowd went wild. It's great, the crowd's great. I mean, they don't know that song yet, so to react that way was amazing. The entire lineup was impressive. Ballerini herself graced the stage with a performance, dazzling the audience. Among the other talented acts were the double award-winning Lainey Wilson and newcomer Jordan Davis, who teamed up with the rockers Need to Breathe. We were also treated to live vocals by Cody Johnson and the energetic Jelly Roll. Bunny XO, wife of rapper-turned-country star Jelly Roll, beamed with pride. Like, what do you say to the man who gets everything he dreams of? <laughs> it's crazy. I cried today. The night was also filled with heartwarming comebacks. Little Big Town and Sugarland, who hadn't graced the stage for over a decade, delivered a powerful performance, inspiring other artists with their enduring success. Well, we got some good stuff coming up. Speaking of inspiration, the red carpet buzzed with exciting news. <laughs> yeah, we're going out on tour with Little Big Town this year, and we're announcing today, so all the fans are excited. And Austin singer Dasha and country legend Jason Aldean were surprise additions to the performer lineup. Aldean's return marked his ninth appearance at the CMT Awards after a brief hiatus due to criticism surrounding a music video. But as loyal fans often do, they welcomed him back with open arms. Here's to seeing more of Jason Aldean on the stage in the future. The CMT Awards wouldn't be complete without a heartfelt tribute, and this year it went to the legendary Toby Keith, who tragically passed away earlier this year. A true country icon, Toby earned an impressive 30 CMT nominations and seven wins throughout his incredible career. A star-studded lineup took the stage to remember the hitmaker, including Brooks and Dunn, Lainey Wilson, Sammy Hagar, and Jason Aldean. Adding an extra layer of emotional depth, Toby Keith's longtime bandmates, Lucas Nelson and Roger Clemens, delivered a poignant performance. The emotional tribute culminated in a touching moment as both the singers on stage and the entire audience raised their red solo cups in a final toast to Toby, a nod to his iconic anthem, Beer for My Horses. Repeat after me, whiskey for my men, and beer for my horses.
Let's go! Now, let's get down to business. The winners. Lainey Wilson took home Female Video of the Year for her infectious hit, Watermelon Moonshine. In a heartfelt speech, she championed women in country music, thanking everyone for their support. The award for Collaborative Video of the Year went to Carly Pierce and the one and only Chris Stapleton for their tearjerker, We Don't Fight Anymore. Rising star Ashley Cook took home Breakthrough Female Video of the Year for Your Place, while Warren Ziders snagged Breakthrough Male Video of the Year for his track, Pretty Little Poison. But the night truly belonged to Jelly Roll. He swept the Performance of the Year Award for his unforgettable appearance at the 2023 CMTs. His emotional acceptance speech revealed that this event marked a major turning point in his career, making the win even sweeter. One year ago, I was invited to perform at my first award show. And what I'm emotional about is in that last year, you have changed my life in every way I would have never thought my life could be changed. But wait, there's more to Jelly Roll's winning streak. He also snagged the coveted Best Male Video of the Year Award. The cherry on top? He even took home the ultimate prize, Video of the Year. In his final acceptance speech, Jelly Roll showered his friend and fellow competitor Cody Johnson with love. But I love you, brother. You are my favorite cowboy forever, forever, and ever. He then capped off the night with an electrifying closing performance. Bravo, Jelly! The awards show also saw a touching moment with the inaugural June Carter Cash Humanitarian Award to the legendary Trisha Yearwood. This special honor celebrates artists who demonstrate exceptional dedication to their communities and fellow musicians. Trisha's co-star and June Carter Cash's close friend, Dr. Quinn herself, Jane Seymour, presented the award. Yearwood's acceptance speech left the audience captivated. I really look at this as a challenge and a calling just to be better. Um, Garth and I believe to whom much is given, much is expected. And if you know me, my mantra is love one another. And so my challenge to all of us is to not just say it, but let's actually go out there and do it. Thank you. And she truly stole the show once again with the world premiere of Put It In A Song, the lead single from her upcoming album. But that's not all. Interestingly, Beyonce managed to steal the show even though she wasn't there. Her influence was undeniable throughout the CMT Awards, both on the red carpet and on stage. It's no surprise, considering her recent album Cowboy Carter celebrating the black roots of country music. Mickey Guyton, a rising black country star, revealed she received a special note and flowers from Beyonce as a token of respect for fellow black artists in the genre. Country music is such a beautiful genre and it's such a beautiful community of people. So it just means a lot that she's here and, and it's, the work is working. Brandy Cyrus also acknowledged Beyonce's impact, likely influenced by her sister Miley Cyrus's recent collaboration with the Queen Bay. For her to get to work with one of her idols, I know how much that means to her. So I just think it's so iconic and it's so like true to her roots too, the song. Even Kelsey Ballerini, the host for the evening, gave a shout out to the powerhouse duo. The duet with Miley is my favorite on the record. This is my official petition for Miley to be the next person to make a country record. There's room for everyone. This unexpected Beyonce presence throughout the night leaves us wondering, could we see these superstars gracing the CMT stage next year? Who else deserves recognition at this major country music event? Let's keep the conversation going in the comments below. And of course, stay tuned for more exciting news and updates. Hey.